Hi, hello boys and girls, Pedro Gonzalez from Los Hermanos. Well, it's been a long time since we made our last record. Uh, we've been quite busy doing things and actually having no, no time for video, but we want to make one, um, a small one for you today. And let me show you this kite. This is the, the latest design from Stephen Oath and, and Susan, Susan Oath as well. Um, it's based on their model, the, the Flower Power, and this is called Ibiscus for obvious reasons. Uh, this one is going to, to Lisa Willoughby in the, in the States. We hope uh, you will enjoy it, Lisa. Uh, it's a privilege to work for such a lady. Um, well, we love to, to make cats for you. And there is a, an interesting thing that we want to show you. Um, there is one, one, one thing that we received the, the most as... Um, um, what's the word? Well, whatever. Something that happens with the, with the revs. And let me explain you what it is. Um, it's um, related to the to the sparse. Uh, there is um, the chance, not not always, but sometimes, where the the spar is touching the the sail. There is a chance that it breaks and makes little holes. More if you if you fly on the beach. Normally there is like a sandpaper effect that may uh, break the, the kite actually. So we received lots of, um, of people, uh, we talked with lots of people having that problem. And well, we developed a solution time ago uh, that we've been using with uh, great success. And it's actually couldn't be any easier. If you take a look at this, um, this is part is uh, a sleeve with what we call um, a spar sleeve, uh, which is nothing else than uh, an Icarex, Icarex tube. That, uh, well, let me show you how, how this thing works. It's pretty easy. All there is to it is just, um, I will take it out. It's just a piece of uh, fabric, and in that case, it's Icarex fabric, okay? Which is being sewn into a tube. All you have to do is put your spar, any spar, inside the tube, and it's open on one side and closed in the other side. Here it's closed, so it stays there. And it's that simple to use. All you have to do is go to your kite. And we tend to use the, the closed part here in the top because we have the, um, the end cap, uh, which is uh, a little stiffer in here. So we just put it in there. Then you go down. And as you see, you have a, a piece of fabric that is left in here. So you use it to pull and then to put it inside of the end cap. That simple. So that way, there is um, a barrier in between the spar and the fabric, which is fabric against fabric. And in our experience, it's never break uh, since we use the, the kite sleeve, uh, the, the spar sleeve. So feel free to make them yourself if you feel uh, like you can sew it. It's pretty easy, actually. If not, you can always contact us. We, can, we are selling the, the set of two for just five, five euros plus seven, which is almost free. Um, but if you can do it, just feel free to make them. Uh, we sell them because we want you to have no problems with the, uh, with the kites and to, to avoid a little breakage in here. So that being said, let me show you again the beautiful kite we made for Lisa. Beautiful work from Stephen and Susan Oath. Uh, that's it for now. Bye bye boys and girls. See you soon.